Yeah, you can just feel the buzz of this city all day long, and we are seconds away now for this opening face-off. Don't you just love playoff hockey? Listen to this place. Let's get after it. Scores! And they're on the board quickly in this one. That's because they were ready, James. Uh, I mean, the first five strides right from puck drop were urgent, and when you're aggressive and you're urgent on the puck, you find a way to put it in. This is exactly why you send bodies to the front of the net, James. You want to create a screen, and the goaltender drops into the butterfly position as a default and is battling to find the puck. Can't find it and beats him clean. St. Louis executes the quick shock and awe campaign with that quick snipe. James, this is a testament to their preparation, whether it's their pregame, in the dressing room prior to the game, and then from the opening puck drop. I mean, they attacked right from the get-go. They jumped to their step, urgency, and of course, they were able to execute. Drills them! He knew exactly what he was doing with that hit this early in the game. He's trying to send a message and dictate the pace. Here's a pass in front! And he denies that great opportunity there! Lots of time left in this period. 1-0 is where we sit at this point. St. Louis takes possession off the draw. Quick feed to Bushnevich. Oh, smart heads up play to poke that one away. Can't keep a hold of it as he's jostled off the puck. And now he moves it quickly to Crew. Thomas broke the tie earlier, and now he's looking for more, James. He loves to attack the net. draw. Now let's see what they can do with it. Oh, what a save! It's stopped it! Wow! Oh, that's an intangible effort that you can't teach, James. That's all about desperation and the will to stop that puck. Gets it over to Gunther. Dermott's gonna play it against the half wall. The Blues have it from their own end. Along the right side into the offensive zone. Ingram's last save was absolutely incredible, James. Not only was it pure desperation and athleticism, but I'm not sure how he can stretch that puck. And he rings the post! The Coyotes are trying to shrink their deficit in this game. They're playing aggressive in the offensive zone, and they just wire one off the post as they try and claw their way back in. And he loses possession of the puck after trying to make one too many moves. Gunther's known for his creativity, and he tries one too many moves there, and he loses the puck. Slides the puck into the offensive zone. Blocked aside. Inching closer to the midway mark of the period, St. Louis leads it 1 0. And momentum on their side as they win the draw here inside the offensive zone. Biddington's going to elect to just hang on for a whistle. Well, he hasn't been busy, James, and I like that he landed on this one. He's physically engaging, keeping himself in it. Both teams readying here for the faceoff. Sunfist won it off the faceoff. Can't keep a hold of the puck after that play. St. Louis with possession in their own zone. Picked up along the wall by Sunfist. And he slides it quickly to Stetcher. Moves it on over to Saad. Nice zone entry from the right side. And he totally whiffs on that one. Oh, love the defensive stick work there to poke that one away. Here's a sprint for the loose puck. The Blues have it now. Slides the pass over to Neighbors. Here's a chance to touch. He scores! What a goal! What a beautiful play as they catch their opponent flat-footed on transition and they create the numerical advantage. Odd man rush, perfectly executed. Speed, puck movement, and of course, finish. Yeah. 
Blaze won the draw at center. Quick pass to Walker. A little dipsy doodle, and he loses possession of the puck. Walker's trying to get a little too fancy with the puck there, and as a result, he loses it. And lowers the boom with a big time hit. Well, oh, this is a message sending hit, isn't it? When you get all of your opponent and you're able to separate the body from puck, you know you've done your job. Message delivered. St. Louis has it against the half wall. Takes the puck into the corner of the offensive end. Arizona's looking to break out of the wall. Oh. Make a change, make a change. Stetcher's got it against the boards. Sends it out in front. And he shuts down a great scoring chance there. And that carries off a body in traffic. Arizona's got a hold of it against the wall. Oh, what a denial by Benton. They are really pouring on the pressure here. James. Shen 
Orton's got it into offensive territory. Here's a shot. And he comes up with the glove save. The centermen glide into position. Wins it, they'll go to work now on the attack. Into the offensive zone. And he lowers the boom there. Handles the puck. There's the end of period number one. Both teams will grab a quick breather. You can grab a hot dog, and we'll be back with second period action in moments. Seeds teams are on the ice. They're ready to drop the puck here for period number two. Now let's see who comes out hungry here in this second as we are still tied. Well, Cheryl, already a third of this one played. What do you make of this one? St. Louis needs to dig deep in the second period to change the outcome. It's a tie game, but they've had the minority of shots in the offensive zone. they got to drive the paint. Most importantly, they have to have a lot of motion and attack mentality when they're around the net. And he takes the dish. the puck over. And that doesn't reach the net. Tries to feed it over to Shen. Pokes it away to stay on the attack. Oh, he got paddled by Ingram. Denies him again. Arizona's got possession of the puck. Here's a short pass to Keller. The Blues get a hold of the puck in their own end. Oh, look at this. Here they come. They've got numbers. Angles it over to Zucker. Puck jumped in, allowing for the blue line to get some fresh legs out there. Fultz taking it from his own end. The Coyotes look to start the transition game. From center, they get into the attacking area. Sends it in front. Oh, and he comes up with a stop. There's another stop. He does a great job of having sound positional play based on where the puck is on that low inner slot. And he makes it. Oh, a Offensive zone. St. Louis moves ahead with the puck. Quick feed to neighbors. And that's hooked away. Handles that one. Ingram's gonna keep and hang on for the whistle and just slow it down a little bit here. Now the goaltender, you always have to be mentally focused and ready to make a save, James. He hasn't been busy this period, but they're in the lead, so it's a safe play he elects to hold on. wins the defensive zone faceoff. Moves it in front, and that's stopped. That opportunity is rejected. Cutting to the slot, puts it wide of the net. Uh, and you can see the frustration. You're not 
going to get a better look than that, James. The goaltender was aggressive, challenges, and he just misses it wide. Feeds it over to Krug. And they'll go on the attack. Great pressure by Michelli. And that's deflected off someone in front. Quick pass to Torchoko. Here's a shot. Stopped by the goaltender getting a piece of that one. Oh, what a little beauty stop right there. Ingram's made a great quality shot look easy. I mean, he is so efficient. He's dialed in, he tracks, and he makes a save. Scooped up along the wall. Oh! Such an impressive save. Love looking at this one again, James. You know that this goaltender is dialed in so focused when they're doing everything to get to the puck and keep their opponent at bay. Here in the back half of this period, Arizona's got a 3-2 lead at this point. McBain's won a big draw on their own end. Oh, he got all of that. What a save by Ingram. And they'll get a breather as the goaltender covers it up. The Coyotes have had a lot of jump in their steps since the drop of the puck in this one, and they lead it here in this second period. Offense is on face off, and he wins the draw. Picked up along the boards by Shen. Pass back to the point. St. Louis looks to attack. Receives the pass. Hayden's loving the puck. Down the left wing, they gain the zone. Takes a shot. Denies him. He got all of it. Moves it to Boyd. Let's move to the middle. Great defensive hits up play to pick it off. He to the middle. And he denies that great opportunity there. And the puck escapes the zone, and they'll be forced to tag up. Great use of the twig as he pokes that one away. Moves it quickly over to Boyd. St. Louis takes possession along the wall. Here's a short pass to Hayes. Oh, look at this chance. Good heads up defensive play as he extends the stick. Gets the puck in deep. St. Louis gains a hold of the puck against the boards. Passes on over to Kairou. St. Louis looks to break out in their own end. And that puck leaves the zone. Grabbed along the board by Kairou. Broken up with a little physicality. Directed over to Hayes. And he's knocked off the puck there. Beautiful read in the defensive end by Sundquist. Inside the offensive end now down the left. The Coyotes played along the boards. Fires it! Oh, what a paddle save on the play! Ref blows the whistle as the puck's covered up. Arizona's been putting lots of pucks on net all night long, and they lead it here late in the second. Puck picked up by Scandella. The Blues take it along the wall. The Coyotes gain possession. And he takes the feed. Steps inside the line. Big time collision, and look at that. He landed right on his own bench. Well, you know that the one giving the hit likes this to send a message, send you right over the board into the laps of your teammates. It's embarrassing either way. No question that you got off your feet and you wound up on your bench. He Position and then slide it in right by the post. Arizona's got to be feeling good about their game here as we head towards the intermission. Already up by two now, late in period number two. Well, let's face it, it's been a hard fought battle, but that last goal, I mean, it puts them in a great spot heading into the intermission. You got to find a way to elevate off of it and keep the foot on the gas. There's a collision. The Blues take it along the wall. And it goes off a stick. Official blows the play dead as the puck goes out of bounds.
in the final moments of this period. Arizona's got a two-goal lead. They'd love to build on it. Back underway as he wins the draw inside the offensive zone. Quick feed to Pareko. Denies him! The Coyotes gain control of the puck against the wall. And that's knocked away in the defensive end by Pareko. Moves it up through the middle for the right. We've played not one, but two periods now tonight. It's a chance to go grab that final snack. Go stretch your legs, because a big third period is just around the corner. And they are ready to drop the puck on period number three. Final frame is underway here. Two-thirds of the way to the finish line, and this one for regulation time, Cheryl. How do you view it? The Coyotes are ahead in this game in the third period, James, but the question is for how long? I mean, the transition and the counterattack happens so fast. Goaltenders are left hung out to dry. This game is all about offense. Arizona's put a lot of shots on net here, and they lead it as a result early in this third period. They win the faceoff here in their own end and take possession. Gains the zone through the middle. Quick pass to Schultz. And that caroms off a body in the lane. Puck grab by Buchnevich. Shot! Oh, look at the glove save by Ingram. I love that he swallowed this one up with his glove. It's a real threat coming from the slot area. No rebound to boot. We're still in the early stages of this period. Arizona's been the better club as they hold a 4-2 lead at this point. And with the centers tied up, he swoops in to take possession. Arizona's got the puck in the defensive end. Moves it to Gunther. Poked away at center by Pareko. Sends the pass over. Quick shot! Oh, how did he keep it out? What a blocker stop by Ingram! Fires it on net! Turns it aside with the glove. Centers are lined up, and we are ready to resume. And a solid job tying up his opponent. Comes up with the stop. St. Louis has it in the defensive end. Centering feed! And he shuts down a great scoring chance there. Moves it quickly over to Kairou. Moves the puck. Makes the save. Ingram's been solid here tonight, James. I mean, look at his save percentage. He's been excellent between the crease, and that's making the saves that you need to and you want to at the appropriate moment. Man, his team's been effective going north. The Blues carried along the wall. Denied by the goaltender. Nowhere for that shot to go through. Oh, thunderclap and knocks him off the puck. The Blues played along the wing. Across to Keller. Puts it on net, and he makes the save. Slides it diagonally to Sunfist. The Blues gain possession along the wall. Good defensive stop with the poke check. Arizona's got control of it now from their own end. Schmaltz gains the line and into the offensive zone. Oh, misses the net. You know Cheryl. Well, he certainly will, James. That puck is following him around, and you can see he saw the opening, but wasn't able to put it on net. The Blues gain possession in their own end. St. Louis with possession in their own zone. Moves it around along the half wall. Oh, he got a save on the one-timer! We haven't even hit the midway mark of the period. It's a two-goal lead here tonight. 4-2 is where we're sitting. 
The Blues will start off on the attack after winning the draw. Goaltender hangs on for the whistle. Centers are set, face off ready to resume play. And sneaks in there on the tie up and comes up with the puck. Here they come, down the left side on the attack. Stops the rocket of a shot. Pennington's got it, and the officials blow the play dead. Well, and this is a smart play. He's been dialed in all night and recognizes that he doesn't want his team to make any mistakes. The safe play sometimes is to hold on. The Blues win the draw here in their own end. And he loses both the puck and his balance after that hit. Great save from in tight. Both sides mixed up for that battle for the puck along the wall. And that's a smart heads up play by Thomas. Oh, and that'll make his teammates take notice on the bench after that hit. The Blues scoop it up along the boards. McBain's really impressed me with that last play, James. I mean, to have the wherewithal to hold on to that puck. I mean, that's tenacity on your way down, falling to the ice and still get the shot off. That's leadership at its best. Look at this down the right wing. They're on the attack. Here's a shot. That's blocked. Kairou's got the puck in his own zone. To the low slot. Broken up with the stick in the defensive end. And the puck's not loose. Picked up along the wall by Super. Can't hang on to the biscuit after that. Arizona's looking to break out. Oh, what a chance to make a nice move, and the puck disagreed with him. Zucker is so difficult to stop in tight, and he's got magic hands, but unfortunately this time it doesn't go his way as he tries to get a little nifty. Sometimes simple is the best way to go. Hammers the shot, and that's blocked from someone in front. Taken by Stetcher. Works it across to Fulton. Takes the feed. Looking to make something happen along the boards. And that's intercepted by Neighbors. Arizona's got the puck along the wall. Takes the pass. Broken up with the stick in the defensive zone. And he's ready for that save. The Coyotes move the puck in the defensive zone. Gets the full use of his stick on the poke check. Back to the blue line. Look out! Trailing late in the game, you need a spark. You need to change momentum, and that is why that hit is delivered. Let's check in with our own Carlin Bay that went side. Thomas looks great tonight, and it's hard to deny. He's been the better player when you look at the score sheet, so I'm giving him the edge. Guys, back to you. And a poke check knocks the puck away. St. Louis gains a hold of it. Here they come up along the wing. Slick feed. Battle along the boards. Arizona's got a hold of the puck now. Kraus plays it along the wall. Arizona's got the puck in the corner. The Blues have a hold of it in the defensive zone. St. Louis plays the puck along the boards. Ingram's got the puck and hangs on for a whistle here in this third period. Well, he's been one of their best players all night. The reason why they're leading here in the third, James, but it's not just about the save. It's about managing the puck and making the decisions when to hold on. The Coyotes win the draw. And now it's grabbed by Bugstad. Moves along the boards with some purpose. They dump it in and will change personnel here. Passed up ahead. And here's a pass to Kairu. Shot! And the goaltender comes up with a piece of it to keep it out of the net. And the fans on their feet recognizing a solid victory here in front of them. And he'll hang on to the puck for a much-needed whistle. Well, and this is huge, James. You're going to slow the game down, get a line change. There's no one happier than the coach right now. The Blues need to find a way to convert one here late as they trail in the third. And off 
the draw, they'll take possession. Officials ready to drop the puck and get things back underway.